Hey everyone, this is going to be a short video on configuring offset lists in EIGRP. So looking at our topology, we can we could see, and actually let me first go into the equipment. From R2, to get to R6 is loopback, we can see that we're learning two different routes, and they both have the same metric. So the route metric of this one is 10880, same here. So instead, let's try to configure an offset list to prefer the route through 5 to R6. Now, in order to do this, we can go on R2. And the first thing we need to do is configure an access list. So we're just going to con configure a simple access list. We'll just call it access list 1. And we're going to permit host. 6.6.6.6. .6 now what we do is we're already in configuration mode. Router EIGRP CCIE. I'm doing named mode and we're going to do address family IPv4 unicast autonomous system 100. From here we have to go into the topology base. And you can see the offset list is to add or subtract offset from EIGRP metrics. So since both these routes have the same metric, we can offset one of them to prefer um, to prefer the other, the other one. So let's go ahead and configure offset list. We could see it asks for the access list we configured. And now we can do in or out. You may think that what we want to do is perform offset on outgoing updates but we want to perform them on incoming updates. So remember, this isn't performing them on incoming or outcoming traffic, it's performing it on the updates. So think of it like this. We are learning an update of the route, and let me get my pen going. We're learning it from R5, then we're learning it from R4. So when the route comes in, we want to prefer this one. So what that means is, on the route from R4, we're gonna we're gonna apply our offset list and increase the metric so that R2 thinks that it's a worse route. So it's an incoming route. And we're just gonna offset it by a thousand. We're gonna say the metric is a is a thousand worse. And then all you do is configure the interface. Two, three, four. Now we can show IP route for 6.6.6.6. And you can see um, it hasn't hit yet. So let's uh, give it a minute. There we go. Took a little bit to converge. Route 5, or R5. And it has the same metric because remember we didn't actually impact this at all the the from r5 to r2 if we do a show ip eigrp topology we can see that we're still learning the route it's just the metric is worse so we're here the metric is 1392640 here the metric is a thousand worse which is 3640 now, from R2's perspective, we could do a trace route to 6.6.6.6 and it goes from R5 to R6. So, it's a short little video about how to configure an offset list in the EIGRP.